most people think that, oh, well, what we do is we're going to add the market caps of store of value, medium exchange unit of account, and we're going to get to the, the total value or addressable market of Bitcoin. And now if you look at that, it's 10 trillion in gold, roughly 100 trillion in USD and 2000 trillion in unit of account. Add those together, you get to $2.1 quadrillion. Divide it by 21 million, you get to $100 million a coin. When you understand that Bitcoin's the best at store of value, medium exchange and unit of account, what I call the first triple point asset. It's the first time in history we've had one asset that dominates all three functions of money at the same time. We're going to have competitive tension across each of those functions of money for access to Bitcoin. So you're going to have store of value competing with medium of exchange, competing with unit of account, all for that precious space on the blockchain. So what does this mean? Rather than thinking it of Bitcoin and the, the market cap is going to be an accretive value, it's not. It's going to be an exponential value where you need to multiply that together because you've got competitive tension competing for that single asset. And we've never had those three silos of functions of money where we've had one asset to rule them all. And now we do. And so when you look at that, a crazy valuation of $10 billion a coin makes a whole lot, lot more sense when you put it into that context. Be 